Hi, and welcome to a new episode of The Young and the Restless. We open up and we see Nikki visits Summer at the coffee house. They ran into each other, I mean. And she asks about her and Kyle. And Summer announced that they are getting a divorce and tells Nikki that Kyle has moved on with Arja. Nikki is disgusted. Then we see over at the athletic club, we see Kyle and Audra are dining and then Nate comes by and interrupts and asks to talk business with Audra, asks to speak to her in private. Then we see Jack visits Ashley upstairs in her room. He says he wants to check up on her after the choking incident and Ashley calls it ironic that Diane saved her life. Then we see Billy is at a jazz lounge drinking alone at a bar and he comes And he's there reflecting on Jack and him possibly accusing him of trying to take over Jabot. Then Adam comes down and sees him. And Billy jokes about seeing the world through Adam's eyes. Then we see Adam questions what would put Billy in such a place. And Billy thinks that he is living in the shadow of his brother and his family. They are not accepting him. Just like how Adam is the black sheep. Adam says that his situation is a whole lot worse than Billy's. And Billy feels that he can't measure up to his family. Then we see Jack express that Diane is concerned about Ashley and thinks that Ashley would have done the same for Diane if it was her. Jack expressed that how grateful he is that she is alive and hopes that it's a wake-up call for them to stop fighting. Then we see Audra express... Kyle should be a part of the conversation and then Nate tells them that Adam is completely out and Nick moves to Newman as the new co-CEO so Audra asks what about Nikki back at the coffee house Nikki and Summer discuss her situation with Kyle and Nikki believes that love can overcome anything but Summer says that she has let go of Kyle Nikki says that she now has the opportunity to dash it out with Audra and put her in her place. Then we see Summer tells her not to do anything to Audra on her account and she wants to keep things peaceful between her and Kyle for the sake of Harrison. And Nikki promised that what she does with Audra won't affect anything with her and Kyle. Then we see Nate announce that Nikki will be running Newman Media. And Audra vents that Victor lied to her, but Nate tells her to calm down and tells her that she will be second in command to Nikki. Audra thinks that it's a doozy because Nikki doesn't like her. Then we see Kyle question where does he it put him? Back in Ashley's room, we see Jack tells Ashley how much he loves her and don't want to lose her and tells her to make it an olive branch. Then Ashley and Jack agree to accept each other's partner, that is Tucker and Diane. And Ashley vows that she will give Diane the benefit of the doubt from now on. Then we see Adam and Billy downstairs in the jazz lounge bonding over similarities between their family situation. But... Adam still doesn't think that they are experiencing the same thing. Adam calls himself cold and says that Billy is a screw up. Adam believes that Jack is fair unlike Victor who give it and take it and says that it's in Billy's hands to screw up unlike his, Victor just takes it away. Then we see Nate tells Cal his name didn't come up in the conversation and Audra questions if the issue with Summer is affecting him. Kyle says that he has no idea and if Nikki knows it will get ugly fast. Then we see Adam has some business plans up his sleeves and says that he will not tell Billy about it. Upstairs we see Jack questions if after this will Ashley still start her new company Ashley says that she will have to talk to Tucker first then we see Ardra goes to the ranch to meet with Nikki and Ardra tries to talk business but Nikki asks what the hell are you doing with Kyle Ardra tries to talk about Kyle in a work center at Newman but Nikki says that we are talking about Kyle and yours fling and Audra defends that they are getting a divorce, so it doesn't really matter. It's not really Nikki's business. And Nikki believes that Audra is standing in the way of a reconciliation between Kyle and Summer. Audra says that Kyle is grown and believes that Summer deserves what she gets. 
she be defends that she didn't break Noah's heart and they both break each other's heart but Nikki can't believe why Aja is constantly getting herself with members of her family. Aja calls Nikki her new boss and Nikki realized that Nate told her. Then we see Kyle run into Summer in the park and she asks about Harrison. They talk about it for a while. Then they discuss Chloe and Chelsea joining Marketty. Then they discuss him struggling at Newman and not knowing where he fits in. Then we see Nate approaches Adam in the jazz lounge and Adam calls him the appointed golden boy and Nate defends that he is damn good and deserves the post. Adam tells him not to get too comfortable because Victor will take it. Then we see Nikki announce that she that she is impressed by Audra's work so far and will give her a chance. And Audra thanks for the opportunity, but Nikki says not so fast. Nikki says it comes with one condition, and that is for her to leave Kyle alone or her future is over. Then we see Summer announced that she hired Heather for the divorce proceedings, this struck Kyle, and Kyle says that it's for the better. Then we see Jack finds Billy at the coffee house and apologizes for their confrontation. And he announced that he and Ashley are reconciling and he doesn't want any issues with Billy. Then we see Ashley is in her room reflecting on John, telling her to not have any animosity with Jack. And it's not good for the company. Then we see Ashley takes Tucker to go to Paris for honeymoon because she wants to get out of town. Thanks for watching. Bye.